Whenever you go into modern radio communication, you can hear or read, depends, terms like LoRa and LoRa Van. And you probably also heard it's amazing and offers exceptional range. But what is LoRa and is LoRa Van the same thing? Let's find out. LoRa and LoRa Van are often confused, but they are not the same. One is a modulation and the other is network protocol. One offers a physical layer, while the other is a communication system built on top of it. Confusing? A little. The same? No, although they do sound similar. To understand LoRa, let's first review modulation basic. Modulation means changing a carrier signal to carry information. Have you ever listened to a radio? I bet you did. In traditional analog systems, we have amplitude modulation or AM, where the strength of the signal changes and the frequency modulation or FM, where the frequency shifts. You know both of them from radio. AM is the old, noisy one. FM is a little newer, clearer radio. This is from where the AM-FM radio name comes from. It's from the used modulation Type. Modern digital systems use more advanced methods. Phase shift keying changes the phase of the signal. Quadrature amplitude modulation combines changes in both amplitude and phase. Frequency shift keying switches between discrete frequencies. These techniques allow efficient and reliable digital communication. And they are used everywhere around you. If you use Wi-Fi, then you use one of the fancy discrete modulation like BPSK, QPSK, QAM and so on and so on and so on. But now let's spread it. Let's move to the spread spectrum modulation. Spread spectrum means that the signal is spread across a wider bandwidth that's strictly required. This makes communication more resistant to interference more secure and better able to coexist with other signals. Two common approaches are direct sequency spread spectrum, DSSS, which multiplies the signal with a pseudo-random sequence, and the frequency hopping spread spectrum, which rapidly changes the carrier frequency. And this is where the good stuff begins. LoRa is a special type of signal modulation developed around 2010 and is currently owned by Semtech. It's patented and Semtech maintains proprietary control over the LoRa modulation. It uses a particular type of spread spectrum modulation called Chirp spread spectrum. Instead of switching between discrete frequencies, LoRa transmit data using chirps. A chirp is a signal whose frequency increases or decreases over time. If I whistle like this, it's a chirp. Each LoRa packet consists of a series of such chirps. These chirps are orthogonal, meaning they can overlap each other without interfering. This makes LoRa robust, even in noisy environments. New word. Orthogonal. If two signals are orthogonal, they can exist at the same time without messing each other up. LoRa modulation offers several unique features. It enables very long-range communication, up to 15 kilometers in rural area. But the records, oh, the records are much bigger. It consumes very little power, which is ideal for battery operated devices that must last for years. It is highly resistant to interference. It supports adaptive data rates, adjusting transmission parameters depending on the signal quality. LoRaWAN is the protocol that defines how devices using LoRa modulation communicate with the network. And LoRaWAN, contrary to LoRa, is not patented. It's open and governed by the LoRa Alliance. The architecture of LoRaWAN includes end devices, gateways, a network server and the application server. Each device sends data. Gateways forward it to network server and server manages authentication, routing and aggregation. 
the application server processes the data. LoRaWAN also includes strong security with AES encryption. It defines device classes. Class A for minimal power use, Class B for scheduled listening and Class C for continuous listening. It ensures compliance with regional duty cycle regulations. Altogether, LoRaWAN enables scalable, secured and efficient intern Altogether, LoRaWAN enables scalable, secure and efficient Internet of Things networks built on LoRa modulation. I'm Paweł Spechalski and this was Hacker University. Thank you very much for watching and don't forget to check out this video next.